Once a businessman got caught in debt real deep and he was not able to think of any way out to sort out that debt. So one day he went out and sat in the park to think if he could do anything to save his company from bankruptcy. While he was sitting in park, an old man came to him and said to him, I can see that something is troubling you. Businessman was sad and depressed so he told that old man everything about his problem while old man listened to him patiently. Old man smiled and replied. I believe I can help you. Old man put his hand into his pocket and took out a checkbook and asked that businessman his name then giving that check to businessman. Old man said. Take this money. Meet me here exactly after one year from today and you can pay me back at that time. After handing that check old man got up and walked away. Businessman had mixed feelings. He looked at that check and saw that the amount written on the check was to settle all his debts. When he looked at the signature, he saw the name of the world's billionaire, Warren Buffet. Businessman realized that with this amount he can easily get out of his debt but instead he decided to put that check in his safe and to use it only in case of emergency. With that check businessman felt more confident. With changed thinking businessman went back and his business he was able to think better and negotiable better deals. He started reconstruction his business and worked really hard with full zeal and enthusiasm and with time got several big deals. Within few months businessman was able to get out of his bet and also started making money back. Years passed, as promised businessman returned to park after exact one year with same check which old man gave him. As agreed old man also appeared. Businessman was very happy to see old man and told him about his success story. As businessman was about to hand old man back that check. A nurse came running up and grabbed old man by his hand and said, I am so glad I caught him. I hope he has not been bothering you much. He always escaped from mental hospital and tell that he is Warren Buffet and nurse took that old man away. Businessman was stunned. All year long he was dealing with all this problems thinking that he had this millions check with him. Achieving our dreams is about more than just having money. It's true. The way we think and how much we believe in ourselves play a huge role. Imagine your attitude as a special pair of glasses through which you see the world. If you wear positive glasses. Challenges look like opportunities. That's attitude. And then there's self-confidence, which means trusting in your own abilities. It's like having a superhero inside you who knows you can do it. When you believe in yourself, you can do amazing things. Money is like a tool, it helps us get things done. But without the right attitude and self-confidence, money alone can't make our dreams come true. When we combine a positive attitude with strong self-confidence, we become super-powered. We can face challenges, learn from mistakes, and keep going until we reach our goals. While money has its place, remember that your attitude and self-confidence are like the real magic. They're what give you the power to turn dreams into reality. Believe in yourself, stay positive, and you'll see how you can achieve anything you want in life. Getting what we want in life isn't only about having money. It's about how we think and how much we believe in ourselves. Our attitude, which is how we see things, and our self-confidence, which is how much we trust ourselves, are like superpowers. They help us reach our goals and make our dreams come true. While money is important, our attitude and self-confidence give us the real strength to overcome challenges and achieve anything we set our minds to. So, remember, believing in yourself and having a positive outlook can take you farther than money alone ever could.